I've nominated the North Lincolnshire Case Management Service for Continuous Service Improvement Award. The Case Management Service came to Ardash in late 2017 from um, the CCG. Since then, the case managers, which there's two, of, two case managers and a senior admin support, have worked um, really hard to streamline the processes, put pathways in place and support people. Um, at present we have over 100 people on our caseload and our, our role is to ensure that people are getting the right care at the right time in the right place but it's balanced against a cost effective price. So a lot of our role is really trying to release money back into the um, CCG and into the care group and since the transfer of the service we've made a huge saving which a significant amount of that has now been put back into North Lincolnshire Care Group and has an end has enhanced some of our services within the care group. I've nominated the community nurses from our learner disabilities team over in North Inks for the implementation of new clinics that will be run from the Ironstone Centre in Scunthorpe. These clinics will be a significant improvement on the service that we already provide as they're going to be more community-based and a true experience for our service users that will be using our service. Not only will it improve uh, medication monitoring and physical health care, it will improve the quality, genuine quality of life of the people that we care for. Learning disability analysis is all about inclusion, service improvement and health promotion and also giving culturally valued experiences. I think these clinics will do exactly that. Hi, I've nominated the Doncaster Early Intervention Team for this award for all the dedication and hard work that all the team members have put into the team over the last couple of years to help to develop the service. We've worked on many developments within the team. We now um, assess and put people into treatment within two weeks. We've developed an at-risk mental state pathway. We've um, opened and run a physical health clinic uh, to monitor people's physical health. We've also introduced a, a family intervention pathway where we've trained a number of staff within the team to deliver uh, behavioural family therapy. We've also introduced a number of roles throughout the team um, and we've increased the capacity of current roles. So I'm nominating the community therapist team based at East Dean uh, for the Continuous Service Improvement Award um, because the team have clear common goals, um, they have a low staff turnover which helps them to be resilient, cohesive and compassionate not just with the patients and the carers um, but with the team members themselves. Um, they, this team tell me that they feel confident and empowered uh, which allows them to, to develop their team and develop the service in an innovative and responsive uh, approach. We've also developed a review clinic which enables us to allocate a lead professional to every patient from day one of joining our service and we've had lots of positive feedback that this is really helpful. Patients know who they can contact in a crisis and it's somebody to coordinate their care and develop care plans with them. Education is a key part of the team's role, delivering palliative and end-of-life education Doncaster-wide to health professionals. This year the team have reflected on how they can support wider pathways with end-of-life care and education and we've developed a more structured way of working with community nursing, GP practices and care homes in Doncaster. The team's ownership in driving this work forward should be commended. <laughs> 